Let's convert the following to of the left side to the right side of this equation, proving that these two equ equations, these two identities are equal to each other. What I'm going to do first here is I'm going to focus on the inside here. I'm going to use the sum to product to product form. So rewrite this here as sine theta times. What here, based off of this, we can go ahead and we can use um, the top equation right here. So we get 2 sine 3 theta plus 5, five theta divided by 2 times cosine Three th excuse me, um, 3 theta minus 5 theta divided by 2. So what we get here, sine theta times 2 sine uh, 8 theta divided by 2, which is 4 theta. And then this is negative 2 theta over 2, but because cosine is an even function, it just sim simply becomes cosine theta. And after this, what we're going to do is we're going to swap out the sine and cosine um, so we can manipulate this like we want to. So we're going to get cosine theta times 2 sine 4 theta sine theta. And then now what we're going to do is a product to sum uh, conversion. So cosine theta 2 times 1 half. And then what we're doing here is um, this is sine times sine. So we're using this equation right here. We're going to have cosine 4 theta minus theta minus cosine theta plus theta. Now we're going to have sine theta. These cancel each other out. We get cosine 3 theta minus cosine 5 theta. That's it, we just proved it.